Hello, living in Boulder Vlog, where I vlog about my biking. Right now it's 11.27 p.m. on August 19th, so this will be the one for August 19th. Um, hello, living in Boulder Vlog, where I vlog about my biking. Right now it's 11.27 p.m. on August 19th, so this will be the one for August 19th. Um, so today... I uh, went out on my ride at like uh, two or something like that, and I went up to, I was going to do um, Flagstaff and then go to the end of the road, you know, which went down, then I had to climb again and go over the hill, but before I got to the top, um, my MP3 player in the middle of a song just stopped, and I couldn't get it to just turn on again, so I thought I'd like died or something, and so I didn't have the motivation to ride anymore, and I was going to go home. <laughs> But I went to the top of the hill first, and then uh, I was riding down, and <clears throat> I was riding the brakes following a bunch of cars, and uh, and then the brakes started to squeak, like rub, even when I wasn't didn't have it engaged, it was making squeaking sounds, which is really annoying. So I, then I just took it into the bike shop, full cycle, 18th and Pearl, and they fixed it for me. I bought the bike there, so they, you just bring it in and they fix it. And, uh, and then I went up um, Magnolia Road, which is 14%, like I guess for a whole mile. And um, yeah, really steep. And I'm, I'm in like, what are my gears? They're not like, for me, I'm just cranking. Um, so it's really hard. I um, probably waste a lot of energy. But uh, yeah, I, I don't know. Hopefully before long, I'll be able to climb up it without it being a problem. But I'm zoomed down the hill. But I drank all of my water. I had two big, uh, 24 ounce water bottles that I filled up at the bottom of the climb at Evan G. Fine Park because I drank my two water bottles on the climb up, um, uh, or I drank one water bottle, I think, going up uh, Flagstaff and stuff. But then I drank both of them going up uh, uh, Magnolia. So I had to go all the way back down to the, the park again in Boulder to fill them up before I climbed, went up again and climbed um, Sugarloaf to the top, which is steep too. And so, yeah, I was pretty tired by the time I got home. Um, and uh, I was kind of not kind of cloudy in my head, you know, because I was so tired. So I didn't do any work on my website. I was just kind of lounging and trying to eat. And um, I'm still at the beginning of my writing. So, you know, I can't I can't just pig out and like load up on carbohydrates for the next day because I barf. You know, because like my whole body is in shock, not just my legs. So I have to <clears throat> just eat, you know, delicious foods so that I'm crave eating. And um, I uh, love drinking fruit juice with ice at the end of a ride. <laughs> Pomegranate is my favorite. I forgot to get that. I got grape, and I also got grapes too. But I got grape juice and then some kind of mixed berry, which is really good, sugar free. Um, and. Um, yeah, so really the only thing that I had to eat today was in the morning I had a bowl of cereal and then I had two energy packets on the ride and then I came home. It was, um, I'll put the information, it's, it was uh, only like 57 miles, 7,500 feet, <clears throat> 5 hours, 45 minutes of riding, um, something like that. Um, so yeah, I was, uh, and then I came home and uh, I ate a bunch of grapes. I didn't finish them, but I, yeah, I had a bunch of grapes and some fruit juice and and then I just had like a some a couple bowls of um, like potato salad, no clam chowder. I guess I'll have the potato salad after. I was gonna go to Taco Bell, but they were closed at ten. The drive is only open until the twelve. So, because I went to the drive thru yesterday, I love eating delicious food. Taco Bell is delicious, and like something like uh, Subway. And, yeah, that's what I'm gonna focus on. Just the stuff that I want to eat because it's delicious. Because food tastes even better, you know, when you're really hungry. Yeah, that'll keep me eating. <clears throat> and then the juice will keep me drinking. And just take your time. Um, it's, uh, yeah, but I mean, I'd like to, I'm going to pretty soon get going on, keep going on the books here, finish that. But as soon as my weed runs out, I'm going to uh, quit, not buy anymore, because I don't have the money. And also, I, I'll be able to motivate to do all the things I need to do, like sell my car, you know, maybe sell the car. So, yeah, maybe tomorrow I'll do that. So yeah, tomorrow's Sunday, so I'm going to try and do another big full day, um, you know, 
whenever I get up. Um, I slept in today because, um, like, <clears throat> like, I woke up and then I got stoned and then I fell asleep again and I got really tired, like sleepy. And so I was like, oh, cool, let's take advantage of this. And I just slept until you won. Um, my philosophy is if you're training, you know, and you feel like you don't want to get up and sleep and as long if you can get away with it, sleep as long as you need. Because I knew, because yesterday I felt really lethargic, like I was going to pass out. I was like drowsy on the bike because I needed sleep. I slept, I had to nap at my mom's house, but I still needed a little bit of sleep. And so today I didn't, I was riding, I didn't feel like I needed any sleep because I didn't get up until I wasn't drowsy anymore. And it's also awesome to just lay there when you're tired. Because I have insomnia, it takes me forever to get to sleep. Hopefully, though, with the writing. Like a couple hours ago, at like 9 or something, I felt like I could go to sleep then. And then I would have been able to get up early. Maybe I should have done that. Anyway, um, how many long time have I been talking? I'll include a video at the end of my little video of where I went. Okay, peace out. Up north Boulder, there's the uh, reservoir. Happy birthday to my lovely girlfriend, Kirsten. There's Haystack Mountain. And the road. There's my bike.